Hey, you. Yeah, you. Come here. Do you like world building? Do you like worlds of fantasy with dragons and other powerful beings? Of course you do. You see, I have an insatiable autistic appetite for creating some characters that want to explore a vast and awesome world. However, there's one problem. I need to build that vast and awesome world for the characters to explore. What got me into this personal project in the first place? I'm so glad you asked. Have you ever heard of Legends of Runeterra? It's a digital card game based on the League of Legends universe. No, wait, come back! I know I just lost like more than half of the audience, but if you're still watching, I'm sorry. I've never been into card games before, and no matter how much my friends keep trying to get Magic the Gathering, I never got into it. But, Meloir is special from my perspective because of the artwork. Every single one of these cards have a story, and some of them connect. I don't just mean by region, but by characters and plot too. Like this one here, of this yurtle trying to swindle this lady, which ends up with him in this precarious situation. You might have not known any of this if you didn't observe the full illustration. Okay, Weetsy Lean, you've glazed up Alowar, but what does this have to do with the video? Well, that's because Alowar is the thing that really introduced me to the ideas of world building in the first place. Yes, I was and still am invested in the lore of video games such as Pokemon and the Halo universe, but Alowar really got me into the process of it. Now, that brings me back to my project. What I lack in professional skills, I make up for in my indomitable human spirit. I kind of already have some ideas planned in terms of environments, attire, and architecture. My strongest skill is creature design, so I'll start with that. I'm a little split on whether this world is the same or two separate ones as the human character story is more fantastical with battle shown in elements while also wanting to focus on some soft speculative evolution in biology. I'm afraid they might clash too much. I have some rough ideas in terms of which kind of animals you can find, but it's all still a work in progress. This isn't the only project I want to work on, such as a fake Amon region, but I digress. Now, this is where you guys come in. I want to bring you guys along for the ride of this creative project and others as I think it would be a lot of fun not just for me, but for you guys too. I want to give you guys opportunities to participate in the process and ask for input. Maybe I can hold design contests or something. Um, this is the first time I've ever done something like this in my entire life, so I'm very excited for what's to come. If you've made it this far, thank you very much, and if you'd like to join my public discord and or show some extra support, I've made a Patreon down below in the description. Any amount of support allows for your username to be featured at the end of the videos. The $1 tier, Egg, gives you early access to public art one day before being publicly released. The $3 tier, Hatchling, includes everything in Egg, plus early access to sketches, works and progresses. The $7 tier, Nestling, includes everything in Egg and Hatchling, plus access to exclusive polls to help me decide on future works, high quality final release pieces and more. You don't have to support me on Patreon as you watching and engaging with these projects means a lot to me. Patreon is just allows me to focus it most, if not all of my attention on these projects. Again. Thank you for watching.